Just as technology convergence helped propel our ancestor civilizations into new epochs in history, today, incredible technologies across the five foundational sectors of the production system have opened a window into an unprecedented new possibility space. For the first time in history, we can see this convergence and recognize its implications. We need no new technologies, just continuing exponential improvement in cost and capabilities, driving rapid S-curve adoption. Together, they unveil a pathway to a whole new production system and the inevitable collapse of the old. Our ability to process and communicate information has already been transformed. The smartphone, combined with the cloud, AI and the internet, has reshaped our lives from a world of centralized broadcasting, book publishing, newspapers, radio and TV, to one where billions of producers and consumers can connect directly just as the printed book saw church and state lose control over information. Today's information revolution proves how outmodeled are the centralized ways of managing society. The information revolution has rippled out and begun disrupting everything else. Retail, dating, entertainment, banking, transport, materials, and food. Our food system is being transformed as we learn to make affordable, high-quality proteins and other molecules without the need to grow plants and animals. The DNA of a single soy plant or chicken will be enough to create an unlimited quantity of soy or chicken proteins. Our newfound ability to design and produce infinite organic compounds, like we design apps or videos, will likely distribute the power to engineer our own food cheaply, sweeping away the industrial dairy and meat industries. Information breakthroughs in a convergence of AI, robotics, nanotechnology, and precision biology mean we can now 3D print furniture, entire homes, and even human organs. Solar, wind, and battery power have converged to become cheaper than oil, gas, and coal. The cost of solar is becoming so low. Declining costs will make fossil fuels obsolete within a decade, enabling us to affordably build a massive oversupply of energy. Zero-cost superpower, getting us through the darkest days of winter, electrifying everything and allowing everyone to generate, store, and sell electricity in the same way we exchange information. Transport as a service, where electric vehicles, ride-sharing, and AI are converging to make on-demand, electric, and then autonomous electric vehicles the norm, will permanently end the reign of individually owned polluting combustion engines. The costs will drop so far as to make transport effectively free. Just as cars not only replaced horses, but created whole new industries, today's technology changes are already happening faster with greater second and third order effects than incumbents anticipated. These sectors don't exist in isolation, they interact. That's why improvements to communications are transforming transport, changing how we work, shop, educate and entertain ourselves. And yet, trapped by their tunnel vision, our leaders are blind to the possibilities. They see small-scale, incremental change. We see epic, cascading disruptions that can trigger a tsunami of change that will transform civilization. Where do we want this transformation to lead? It's time for us to rethink humanity. This video series is distilled from the book Rethinking Humanity by James Arbib and Tony Seba. Share and subscribe for new content and visit RethinkX.com to read the book.